I'd like to give Mistletoe Magazine the warmest welcome to Dumbrody House. I'm going to show you a fantastic dessert called an opera cake that's going to work perfectly all the way through Christmas. And you know what? It's so simple to make. So the first thing I'm going to show you how to do is make that chocolate mousse. Now I'm going to show you one chocolate mousse, the dark chocolate mousse, but it's the same process for the three chocolate mousses, so the white and the milk. First thing we're going to do is we have our dark chocolate melting down over a pot of simmering water. Now you can see here it's very important that the bowl doesn't touch the water. Then we're going to take one egg, we're going to separate our egg. <coughs> so we've got our egg yolk into one bowl, whisk up our egg white. You can see it's beautiful. So that's done. Take our, our chocolate here, we're going to add in our egg yolk into our chocolate. Give that a good beating. You can see it gets nice and thick, that's exactly right, that's what you're looking for. We've got some whipped cream here that we've whipped up. Not too heavy, so it's nice peaks on it, but it's not, it's not too stiff. Add the cream into your chocolate. You're going to whisk that together until it gets nice and smooth and delicious looking. Get your egg white, put that in. As soon as the egg white goes into your chocolate, you just want to fold it through nice and gently because you don't want to break down all the air that the egg white is actually giving your light chocolate mousse. Mix that together until it's lovely and smooth. And then we're, what we're going to do is we're going to take that Pop that into our fridge until it cools down and sets. It'll probably take about a half an hour or so. All right, so I've made my chocolate sponges already. Really simple to make. Most important thing is when you add your sugar and butter together, get them off nice and fluffy and it's a great tip. Do you know what's really important to have friends and family to help you in the kitchen? So I'm gonna introduce you to two of my kids. This is Sophie Dunlin and this is little Tom. Sophie's 11 and Tom is seven. And we're gonna layer this cake up and we're gonna do a great job. We're going to enjoy it even more. We love chocolate, don't we? Yeah. Drop the sponge into the bottom of our dish. Okay, and then we're going to get our white chocolate mousse. Okay, and spread that out until it's nice and smooth. Okay, and then we're going to get another layer of our sponge. And then we're going to get our dark chocolate mousse. And pour that in. Okay, now Tom, you spread that out, buddy. Give it a little shake. Good man. Grab the other sponge there, Tom. Careful now. Oh. <laughs> okay. Peel that back. Drop it in over your dark chocolate mousse. Does this look yummy? Yeah. And then we've got our milk chocolate. You want to spread that out and give a good tap, then fold in your cling film and then just kind of give it a press down. <laughs> That's the only, <laughs> That's the best part. Okay, it's as simple as that. We're just going to put that into our freezer. Okay, and do you know what's great about this? Is you can actually make this right now at the end of November. Put it into your freezer and take it out just the week of Christmas and all you have to do is put the ganache over top and your dessert is already ready. So I obviously have one that I've made already. We take it out and we're going to pop it out on the tray. It should just like pop out. So you can see all those layers of the chocolate and the brownie mixture and your sponge. It's gorgeous. Okay. Chocolate ganache is chocolate, cream, a little bit of honey, a little bit of water in there. And you get this lovely shine over top. But you can see all that beautiful chocolate just like pouring down over top. And with your spoon, you just want to swirl it around and literally let it, let it drip over the edges. Okay, and we're just going to put that into our fridge. And that's going to set up. And then we'll trim it up. It's going to be ready to eat. But I want you to do me a favor now. I want you to close your eyes and imagine this. You've got white chocolate mousse dark chocolate mousse, milk chocolate mousse, chocolate brownie all layered up. Then we take it out and we put this beautiful chocolate ganache over top. Set it in the fridge, take a nice slice with a beautiful cup of tea. A truly delicious dessert. I'd like to wish you all a very happy Christmas and to Barbara and all our team in the Mistletoe magazine.